Hi everyone, my name is Mo Han Liu. Welcome to my Management 3902 final project. Today I will introduce my final project. So what I made is an application named Quick Cash, which is a recruitment and job research project. And here is my overview for today's presentation. But before the interview, I want to introduce why I create this. Um, the reason of this is because um, for now it is almost graduation season. So a lot of students will be find job and get a work. However, because of the COVID and the DV short software to use, many people and also including those already employed are having trouble to finding the new work. Before I introduce my product, I'm going to show the interviews and comments from employers and employees about the flat platforms that already exist in today. So here's the interview question. What do you think are the drawbacks of the existing job search platform? And here is some answer from my friends. According to this interview result, we can get some main point problem of those platform. For example, LinkedIn is one of the most popular platforms. People who know each other can use LinkedIn to get to know each other well. But if the employer and the employee are strangers, the communication between them will be very inconvenient. What's more, LinkedIn job listing on clear and often mix volunteer offers with real job postings. So it making it difficult for employees to readable and understanding the information details. So for this reason, LinkedIn was suitable for job fairs or offline interviews, which means uh, employers and employees after meet and then they added LinkedIn to get in deep information about in each other. Therefore, LinkedIn is actually more like Facebook, where people who know each other share information. In the context, um, sorry, where people who know each other share information. However, um, after COVID-19, traditional recruitment and job hunting methods, such as offline job fairs, has been gradually reduced. So people are more like to use in technology to get information. And in other hand, for students or job seekers with special majors like programmers or technicians, they do not have board social connections. And because of the COVID-19, they do not have a lot of opportunity to interview offline. So using LinkedIn can not solve the job searching problem for those kind of users. Another example is Indeed. Compared with LinkedIn, Indeed is easier to use. However, if employee use Indeed to find a job, they can only check the company information, like the um, basic information or the email. So they have to communication to the company by using email and they cannot um, communicate to the employer. So finally, employees will have to send the, their resumes through the email address and it also returning to the most traditional mode of the communication. And here is another story. One of my friends works in TD Bank in Vancouver taught me that some job posts on Indeed are just decoration. Some companies have already appointed employees. So they post job information is not they want employees. They just want to post there and let employees know that their company is hearing. And then they can get some employee to interview. So based on these questions, I have an idea to naturalize them. I want to build an application that focuses on making job posting more readable and easier for employers and employees to communicate. 
that user can find job related needs more flexibility through this application, whether it is recruitment or job hunting. And another thing is because of the social nature of those platform, there are certain in defects in privacy protection. So personal information of employee is easy to be leaked. Competitors may also see employees information. So this situation is very dangerous. We also want to build an application that allows strangers to communicate with each other safely. So here are the problem identification keywords. The first one is platform. The second one is privacy security. The third one is confusion of information. The fourth one is inconvenient communication. And the five one is no organization. And in China, there is an application called Boss Zhipin. This application enables job seekers to communication with employees face-to-face -face on the internet. Employee and employer can also understand clearly of the situation between each other. So, which means employee can have a clear understanding of the situation and the salary of the company applying of the job. And employers can also directly understand the basic background and requirements of the employees. And after they talk to each other, if both sides think it's, um, it's a good communication, they will arrange an interview. So this way is greatly improves the efficiency of employee and employers. And it also saves a lot of time for each other. Therefore, I think Canada can also have such a recruitment application to make it more convenient for both employee and employers to find the corresponding needs. And after analyzing the interview data, I got the following PND. The first one is employee needs a job search platform with highly privacy and security. The second one is employees needs to locate job posting quickly, not in scramble. The third one is there needs to be easier communication between employers and employees. And the last one is employers needs to know employees basic information and work exp experience more quickly. Then I get the link canvas. As you can see, my key partner is employee and employer. The key activities of the pro uh, application is employers post job information and employees check job information and search for the job. The key resources for the application is technical platform and an employer who needs to hear employees. So the value proposition is for employer, employee is on demand and it has a convenient communication and the job seekers are more organized. For employee, employer is on demand and it provides the protection job and search message clear. So the customer relationship for my application is support and highly automated because everyone needs job. And if anyone gets a job, they don't need this application and they can like, uh, you uh, uninstalled this application. So, it's very automatic, basically on people who wants job and who wants the employee. So the channel for my application is just the mobile app application. And the customer segment is employee and employer. The cost structure of my application is database maintenance and update. The another one is popular and also look for employers to move in. The revenue streams of my application is employer entry. Employers can buy some additional features. Also employees can buy the promotion cards to get more function. 
And now I will introduce my product. So here's uh, what my application look like. You can see um, you, the user need to register at first. Uh, they can register as employee or employer, and then they need to log in. When they log in, they will get into our main page. You can see the icon here is the chat bar. If you have any message, uh, you want to reply, you can just click this icon and reply the message. But if there's no message uh, and you click this one, it will be empty. So for the employees, they have three, <clears throat> three ways to search the job. The first way is they just search the job name or the um, tag, like keywords. Like if someone wants to have a job with computer science, they can just uh, type the computer science and find job. The second one is they can find the job by checking the distance. Like if you don't want to find the job very far, you can use this way to find job. And you can check the most close job with you. The last way to find job is Mm, they can find by choosing city. If someone wants to go to Toronto, get jobs, they can check, click the Toronto option. If anyone wants to go Vancouver, and then they can just click Vancouver option. And here's what chart bar like in our application. So employee and the employer will, can chat in the chat bar and they can reply each other. And here's for employer. If an employer wants to post a job, they can just post the job title and the description of this job. Then when they click add, the job will be post. And here's the profile like. If the employer wants to check the profile after they have communication and they can get into the profile. And finally, uh, this is our payment system. If someone wants to get some um, extra function, they can use PayPal or pay with card. So this is our, uh, this is my demo project. So for the market opportunity, the first one is employees are looking for jobs and employers need to hire employees who have the knowledge or experience to help run their companies. The second one is some positions are short of manpower. So employers will choose more efficiency to, um, platform for recruitment to find employees to fill the gaps as early as possible the vacant position. And the third one is employees need clear recruitment information to improve the efficiency of information screen and better determine the position being recruited. So for the solution reveal, we can see some current and existing platform will mix volunteer and job information together so that employees cannot quickly and accurately locate the job information. They may choose the wrong recruitment company. Also, some platforms, the communication between uh, employers and employees are not easy. They may only get the corresponding email address through the platform and then turn into a very traditional way which is not a good thing. And it is possible that the mail will be classified as spam by the network algorithm and the message will be missed. And also some platforms have certain privacy disclosure risk. So we need an application to solve this problem. 
So for the solution overview, first, I create an application that has drop information post on it. Then I categorize the type of work. Then I setting up a separate chat bar allows employees and employers to communicate directly. And finally, the detailed biographical information of the employee can only be seen by the employer. No one else can see. If anyone else wants to see, they can only see the basic information like name and major. So finally, for the business model, the company can enter the platform and publish recruitment information on it at any time. If there is an urgent need to fill a position, then the company can buy trading searches to let more employees see the job listings. Second one is after registration, employees can search the post they want to own application like location type and salary and so on. The third one is uh, fresh graduates students can get a one year student tag with their graduation certificate. And they are also recommended to be recruited as fresh graduates students and doors job posting. The fourth one is get the advertising come on YouTube and uh, other public platform to let more users in demand know our applications. And the finally is the database needs to be maintained and updated, and there are no other costs. For the conclusion, Quick Cash is a job application. Employers can search for jobs while posting job information on it. They can also search the employee and choose the best way um, that they want and have communication with them. Uh, employees can search the job by using keywords. Help it helps employees better locate job information. Both employees and employers can communicate through the chat bar of mobile phones. Employers can only check the employee's resume information and work experience after confirmation and communication with employees. It is a good way to protect the employee's personal privacy in a large extent. The use of the chat bar to communicate between employers and employees reduce the time lag caused by email and the risk of missing message. It make communication more convenient for employers and employees to exchange recruitment information. Finally, quick, quick cash is designed for employers and employees to find their demand and communication more easily. It also provides privacy protection for employers and employees. Users don't have to worry about privacy issues. That's all for today. Thank you, guys.